all right guys what's up welcome back to the channel so gonna give you a full rundown of the interior real quick and what we're gonna be doing why you're seeing this color that color and why i'm showing the door panel um i have two videos to show you guys let me open the front here show you guys why um there's two different covers in here don't mind the truck being dirty i just got back from the track but um these are custom interior which has been nothing but amazing the only reason that i'm even going to be replacing these covers again is because i'm actually going to be doing a full laramie interior so when i say full laramie door panels seats um door panel seats dash and center console but the reason it's going to be multiple episodes um, on the channel is because i'm trying to do this as budget friendly as possible um, you could definitely get online and get these you get seats door panels dash probably three to four thousand really really trying to do this all for around two thousand which is going to be tough to do but let me show you guys why i'm doing that and i'm going to start with this door first so this is upgraded from um tradesman I don't, my truck's pretty much a base model i don't want to say it's not but it's a big horn which pretty much only comes with claw seats that's why i have the covers which guys i'm still sponsored by custom interior which all their stuff is in other videos and it's fantastic seat covers i have absolutely no complaints um the only reason i have the blacks up front is because i was literally testing them for them uh but this is technically an upgrade from um a tradesman but i am going to go ahead and pop this door panel off which while i'm in this video let me show you how to do that real quick um you're gonna pull this door handle out pop this cover off there's gonna be a phillips head behind there once you pop that off you got a torx all the way around the door and you're gonna keep working your way once you unbolt that and get those torques off these covers are super super easy i'm literally just going to pull out and push on so this is going to be a pretty short video but i want to show you guys that it is possible to upgrade your cummins especially if you have if you have a tradesman or below this would be a big horn would actually be a pretty big upgrade from that but if you want to go to like a laramie or a limited or a limited long laramie longhorn sorry all this stuff is super interchangeable and done very nicely by ram so let me get this door panel off and show you guys what the upgrade is going to be. And I'm going to uh, also tell you in the video how much I paid for it, which you keep in mind door panel sets, depending on where you're from, a uh, thousand to fifteen hundred for all four. So got a really good deal. And I'm going to show you how you can get a good deal also. So let me get this off of here. All right, guys. So before I put the new door panel in, show you the comparison from the Bighorn side by side to Laramie. Um, Big things, obviously. It's all black. That's nice. Got a little wood trim. This is soft touch. Um, that is a version of soft touch, but not as nice per se. But anyway, the only thing I'm not going to be doing in this video to show you guys is uh, there's ambient lighting. So there's a plug on the back side of this door panel that I'm not going to be doing yet. And that actually illuminates like under there, right there. Obviously, that does not have that. You can wire this into your truck um it does take a separate wiring harness to do that which i'm probably going to end up doing down the road but for right now this is just showing you guys um literally how easy it is to swap laramie door panels onto your big horn or lower trim and why you would want to do it obviously this is way nicer if you're going from like a tradesman pretty much any door panel up from ram is going to be better but this in my opinion is the best one or the limited but the limit is obviously a good bit more. So let me go ahead and toss this on real quick and go. All right, guys, here's the finished product. Um, just a couple things I want to cover is the Torx bits. Um, oh, I forgot to put that piece of pillar back on, but um, the Torx bits around the door are Torx 20 and inside of that is just a Phillips screwdriver. And then when you pop all the door clips off, you're just going to kind of pull it out and pull up at the same time because the clips that they like got into but anyway, um, guys, how you're going to layer me swap your interior so far, unless you guys find like a really good deal on Facebook Marketplace, all this stuff bolts directly up, no problems. But um, how I'm trying to do it is on eBay and I'm actually like lowballing some people on there and I ended up getting this door panel for $100. 
I highly doubt I'm going to get the rest of them for that, but man, I'm going to keep giving it a shot. And the updates, I'm going to literally update as I go because obviously I'm trying to do this to just track my progress on my truck since I've had it. Um, but also to show you guys that you can upgrade your interior, no matter what trim package you have, um, whether it be Tradesman, uh, SLT, Bighorn, so on and so forth, you can upgrade it. Um, I wish I would have been able to have the harness to do the ambient lighting, but that's going to be for another video that I'm going to do. Guys, absolutely no comparison to how much better this looks. This is definitely the route to go, um, in my opinion, or if you can get your hands on a limited. But guys, support those who support you. There's going to be so much more content coming on this truck. I am trying to get my full interior to Laramie, and I'm even trying to get all the pillars um, black, which are going to be off of.